We're in Essex between Chelmsford and Colchester. We've been making jam here since 1885. For us, resource efficiency started with our waste minimisation programme. We started looking at energy, um, looking at then our processes and our production. We used a lot of, a lot of compressed air in our factory. Well, the, the compressors were coming on three quarters of an hour earlier than they needed. They're very electricity hungry. So just by lagging that back a little bit and saying, no, let's put them on when we need them, what a saving it's made. We've done things like um, reduce the thickness of glass in the jam jar, so that, so that we're not using so much glass and, not, and we recycle all the glass. We've recently changed the profile of the cap. That's reduced the amount of tin plate. And inside the cap is a compound that um, seals the cap to the jar. We reduce the amount of compound that we use. Cherry stones we throw away. There's nothing you can do with cherry stones. But somebody said in Switzerland they use cherry stones to make hot stone bottles. Um, so the stones are very good at retaining heat. So they put these stones on the agar and heat them up in the daytime, and then put them in bottles at night to take to bed with. So our waste again was another man's raw material. Every January, February and March we have fresh oranges in from Seville. Those oranges we simmer for four hours in water and we've thrown the water away after we've simmered the oranges. And this came from somebody on the shop floor and said, hang on, we're throwing away all that water. Why don't we use it twice? So we boiled the oranges in the same water and it created a fantastic product. Not only that, part of the recipe for the marmalade that we were making used water. So instead of using fresh water, we used this liquor that we cooked the oranges in. So we've improved the product, we've cut the water usage and we've cut the waste. Waste minimisation resource efficiency never ends. There are always going to be things to look at. It's something everybody can get involved in, from the people that make the tea to the people that meet the customers.